got brutal on the scene, wicked and mean. You know the jump shot clean, keep it a beam. And in the lane, baby, flow the soft with a lean. And when you put me on the block, call me the dream. And now I really played the game, I know the rules. Don't bring me half ass shit, I know the moves. Plus, I know you like the video, so hit that like. Really played in front of Wood up, wood up, it's your boy. You don't know brutal, see on the scene, wicked and mean, with a next video for y'all, man. So y'all know how it is, y'all brute squad, stand up. <laughs> We out here, man. We in the building. We in the building. Anyone y'all got that notification bell on lock? Trust me, man. Put that notification bell on lock and put Bruce Squad in the comment section, man. I do appreciate y'all, man. Y'all know how it is. The grind don't stop. And I got some news for y'all, man. And it's not 2K news but it's still some important news within the gaming community man all right the reason why y'all know how it is man i said i'm gonna upload 2k news every other day because to be honest there's not a lot of 2k news out there right now right so i will still be dropping news depending on what the topic is i'm always in the mix of things always got a bunch of information people always send me articles so i do you know kind of go through them and figure out if I want to talk about this or whatever but remember last week i posted a video talking about google stadia right that was a new gaming streaming system that was about to drop of course which is basically bringing video games like high quality video games to your android devices right now remember playstation and, and microsoft kind of linked up because they start hearing like Google is getting into the gaming industry and they, you know, they're kind of teaming up to try to get rid of the competition. Now, Microsoft dropped. Actually, it's not official yet. Not official, but it's in beta testing. And you could actually sign up to apply for this if you're, if you got an Xbox or whatever. And I think the service right now is free. That, um, I think it's called, I don't want to mess it up. Um, something X something x um project x cloud is the name of the service which is gonna bring xbox basically your xbox to your android devices now the problem is it's only on xbox but there's a battle going on and y'all don't know because y'all stuck in the 2k community and it's so uh, there but right now there's a battle going on for the future of gaming and you all have no idea everyone is thinking about that ps5 or the the new xbox coming out next year but the battle is within the streaming service which is going to be bringing these games of high quality to any mobile devices i'm talking about you could have your ipad probably in the future right now the problem is it's not on apple yet they're not bringing it to apple yet but I'm saying in the future you could be on your Apple devices and or your Android devices and still having that high quality game and uh, um even like the Google Stadia like you could actually pay extra and stuff for the 4K but it did the Google Stadia did have a lot of mixed reviews in terms of the consistency of the frame rate and all that so here's an article from Business Insider talking about this new um microsoft project x you know service that i will actually see if i could put a link in the description so if you all got an xbox y'all could sign up for it so y'all could get to test it out it's currently free free we gotta pay for the google um stadia right now so microsoft already trying to put a little dent in google stadia's launch right so let's check this out real quick microsoft x xbox streaming app isn't official yet but it's already way better than google's new video game service i'm telling y'all man they going for their throat out the gate now here is the opinion right all right they're saying um project x cloud is a new video game streaming service from microsoft that lets gamers stream any xbox one game directly to an android the um, phone now the problem is it's not on iphone i'm an iphone user i'm an apple user so right now i do not have access to this thing i cannot sign up to it because i really have no android device in my entire home y'all all right so i wish like 
I might invest in a cheap nah I won't do it but still if you got an Android device you could definitely sign up for this of course um as i said i'm gonna find a link and put it in the description for y'all so y'all could go sign up if you got an android device to test it out they say during his test period project x cloud is giving users access to dozens of free games in microsoft's cloud or they can stream their own collection from their xbox at home Yo, that's tough, man. That's tough. Project X Cloud uses technology similar to Google Stadia, another streaming video game service that launched earlier this week. However, Google is asking Stadia users to spend $130 US, that is, to access the service. And users only have access to about 20 games. So imagine that, right? Imagine that. They only have access to 20 games. And I watch. I watched a video with someone actually going through the Project X Cloud and they had 50. So they already got more than Google Stadia already, y'all. So they, I'm telling you, like, the war is serious right there. They said many of which are being sold at full price. And Microsoft are offering free, dozens of free games right now. So I'm telling you, Microsoft already going for their throat from the launch. Microsoft is positioning Project X Cloud as a supplement to its existing Xbox business while google is hoping that gamers will ditch their home consoles in favor of its streaming only stadia service now you already see what microsoft is doing y'all i'm telling y'all there's a war out there and i took it upon myself to let y'all know this man so a lot of people still stuck like i'm still thinking about the next gen of course but let's be honest everything is going mobile someone it would be great if i'm at work and chilling i got a little break and yo i could grind my little 2k right here bruh you know what i mean i could grab my little 2k and you could actually hook up your controller to these devices so i could just put my controller of course in my work bag or whatever and then yeah take a little break grind a little 2k come on that's amazing and you could do it on data or you could do it on wi-fi what could beat that i saw the person who was playing um I forgot the game um gear street gears and he said yo i already almost beat this just by grinding this out i'm telling y'all this is the future of gaming that 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 we that we we're not even looking in this direction right now a lot of us are not looking in this direction because we're studying the next gen that 5k or 8k or whatever we're not gonna be you're not going to be seeing a big huge difference in when everyone's thinking about mobile everyone's on the move everyone's trying to you know get a little stuff in everyone's busy doing stuff that's why mobile gaming is so high right now on the food chain and we're missing it because we're stuck in a 2k community <laughs> <laughs> all, right. all right so let's go through a little of this article real quick right it says streaming is the future of video games no less than five major companies are testing or have already launched cloud gaming services that can stream blockbuster games directly to android phones laptops and other devices earlier this week google launched stadia an ambitious streaming only video game platform meant to challenge industry dragons not like Microsoft and Sony. Google claimed that Stadia will eliminate the need for expensive Xbox and PlayStation console, telling Stadia users that they will have access to 4K graphics and the strongest possible computer. Thanks. What? 4K graphics? Wow. That, that's crazy though. 4k graphics on these mobile devices i mean this is a 4k phone but still 4k graphics i like i would not i don't think i could see the effects of 4k graphics on this on a mobile device but it's interesting to see the kind of data this will require to pull this off man all right but anyways man uh, basically i covered everything possible right you know so i'm not gonna keep piling on piling on but i will put the link of this article in the description if you all really want to know what's going on i just wanted to share this with y'all as i said i am gonna put a link as well so y'all could go check out their project x if you all got an android device unlike your boy man i don't have any android devices and yeah y'all could go sign up and have access to it and just do your thing and let me know man let me know if this 
is a good service that y'all will consider in the future all right because i'm telling y'all a lot of them this is where it's at this is where it's gonna be at you might see people streaming from this real soon y'all <laughs> i ain't gonna front with y'all and this was just so amazing to me man and i'm just upset i got an android device so i could be in i would be playing this bro i would i got a bunch of controllers why wireless and stuff like that that i could definitely it, it, like i want some i want to use it like on a mobile just to see how 2k will play imagine me crossing someone over on my mobile device y'all imagine that all right, or playing a little Forza. I see the person was running Forza. They were running Gears. They were running a bunch of games, bro. And it was running so smooth. So smooth. And they wanted the data. Then they switched to Wi-Fi. And come on, man. But anyways, y'all, I just wanted to make let y'all know what's going on. I got to keep y'all in the know. Let me know what y'all think about the video. You already know your boy, Sim, man. You know I got to keep y'all up to date. Don't forget, if you're first time to the channel, to like the video share the video and hit your boy your subscribe if it's not your first time though like the video share the video you never know who's gonna be informed you know, your boy say one love respect bless up peace. Peace, 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 peace and let me know if you all want some more gaming news like this in the mix man all right uh, as i said i get a I, I get a bunch of articles on gaming man and i you know a lot of things i do and don't put out still because i like to keep it 2k but still i could always put in put it in in the mix certain things that stand out like this but so anyways y'all have a blessed one y'all peace